Now to create a brand new Django project, so a Python project which is configured to use Django to help us build websites, such a project can be created by running this Django admin command, which we briefly saw in action in the last course lecture, combined with the start project subcommand and then a project name of your choice. For example, my page. But this project name is up to you. The first two parts are not. So let's run this command. And for this, first of all, navigate to a folder where you want to create this new project. Navigate to that folder here in your terminal or command prompt. You can navigate around with this cd command. So in my case, I will navigate to this Academy Pro folder in the teaching folder in the development folder, which exists on my system, you can navigate to any other folder of your choice, for example, simply to the desktop or anything like that. If you're not sure how to navigate around with the CD command on Windows or on Mac OS or wherever you are, attached you find a resource that helps you with that. Now, once you navigate it into that folder, you have the place where this new project should be created. So therefore here, I now run Django admin, start project, my page, or any name of your choice here, but I will stick to my page. Hit enter, and this will now seem like it didn't do anything, but actually it did create a new folder now in that folder into which you navigated. So in my case, there will be a new my page folder, which was created in this Academine Pro folder. You can see it here. And this my page folder now contains a manage.py file and then a subfolder with more Python files. Now that's nice to have, but I don't want to edit my code or my project here with the default explorer or finder and the default text editor. Therefore, instead, we want to set up a development environment. And that's what we're going to do next.